Right now, Kissimmee police are trying to get your help to track down a rapist. They say a woman was raped in a parking lot between an Asian market and the old Kmart store on Sunday. That's right off West Vine Street near Thacker Avenue. Channel 8 Sierra Putman is back at the scene of the crime. In Sierra, you learned police are hoping that DNA evidence will also help them. And please tell me FDLE will process the evidence that they took from the case that the attack that actually happened here in this parking lot during the day. It's an open space at night. It's a well lit parking lot. Have you seen this man? Have you seen the suspect? No. Wow, they're pretty blurry. I'm, I'm really sorry, no. Blurry, but police hope it's enough for someone to recognize the man wearing jeans and a red shirt with white lettering on the front. He's described as a five foot seven Hispanic man with a goatee and long black frizzy hair between 25 to 30 years old. Kissimmee police say he sexually attacked a woman behind the Jason's Asian Market and in this now closed Kmart parking lot. Elaine Moore and her husband live in Orange County but come to shop at the market. They weren't shocked this could happen here. No, no really. But they were saddened to learn the news. To tell the truth, when we do come over here, you don't really see anything. You see a few people who look like homeless, but that's about it. Irma Sandora agrees. She lives here in Kissimmee. It's not a bad area, so I've never had any problems. Kissimmee police aren't releasing the time of or explicit details about the attack, but the suspect faces a sex battery charge, which means some form of rape occurred. Police plan to send DNA evidence to FDLE to process. They really hope these images, caught by a racetrack surveillance camera, will lead them to their guy. Oh my, that's sad. Well, let's hope they find him and we'll pray we're hard. And police say that suspect was last seen heading southbound on Thacker Avenue. Reporting live in Osceola County, Sierra Putman, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.